did you feel like in something like this, some of the specific things that they mentioned, that your character, and a lot of the stuff that you said for longer than 20 years before you even got here, were sort of under assault? Oh, no, I, you know, I'm not going to talk about that. We'll, we'll, get our, we'll get our day. We'll get our what day. What if you don't? Because a lot of the stuff gets settled without Good. a day. And they will. But the bottom line is, I don't know. See, the difference is, I don't, you know, it's, it's not about what you guys think, it's, it's what I know. So, Gary, is there a way to keep it from being used against you in recruiting? Well, yeah, we already have five commitments. We just had we had another 14 guys in here. Kids know they know us. You know, if you you if you guys read the internet, guys come here. They talk about family. They talk about family atmosphere. Kids that come here recruiting wise, because our kids show them around. Our kids talk about family atmosphere. So, I mean, it's you know the thing about it is kids recruit kids. Recruits recruit. Re Recruits, players recruit recruits. It's not coaches, and kids want to come play with kids and be part of the program. So, do you think this will be solved? Well, oh, I don't know. I mean, right now I'm I'm more worried about my 15 practices and. and I don't know, but this is a distraction. I mean, you got to talk to lawyers and stuff like that. Are you, right. The way it's gone, do you think this will be done? I don't know. Reasonable, or is this going to drag on? I have no hour? idea. No idea. <laughs> Has it come up in terms of just questions from parents or recruits on the no. recruiting trail? No. Not one. Nope. Hmm. You talk about family. You know, because high school coaches know us too, fellas. I mean, you're talking about you're talking about 36 years and 21 years here, and these guys all have worked with us. I mean, it's you now let's talk. You want to talk about stories? How many about talk about stories of guys that you've uh, you you made better, so that and then they wouldn't have had a chance to be successful. Let's see how many of those stories come out. You, you talk about family or lawyer, if so anyway. But this isn't really specific to you. But this is more of a football thing. And that if TCU would have come up with a settlement that this could potentially set a precedent where a lot of former players might go, not just to you, but to any coach, and say, hey, wait a minute, where's mine? Well, I don't know. I think that that's a national thing. Right. Yes, yeah, so but you know, it's, I haven't thought about that. I'm only worried about, right now, I'm only worried about what we do and our kids and our recruits and my staff. And so you have, you know, you have 25 coaches, you have 25 families within your ranks that you take care of as a head coach. Do you have a desire Thanks, to guys, sit down with okay. okay, Coach? Yeah, I'm good. Okay.